Korea testing. Testing. Korea testing. Good evening, Mary. This is uh, 11 July. This is uh, your old man at the 121 Evacuation Hospital, Yongdong, Po, Korea. This is uh, Sunday evening and uh, we've had a very lovely day here for a change. We are in the midst of our uh, rainy season right now, and the uh, the rivers are rising. We've had quite a bit of rain, and no heavy rains, just steady downpours now and then, and the rivers are gradually rising, but today it was a very beautiful day. I uh, I don't have much news or uh, any uh, uh, letters to answer. I uh, I've sent you that uh, Bronze Star and also uh, a the book uh, on Korea culture that I've promised you several months ago. I uh, got that off today, so uh, you get some. You've gotten some packages. Now to tell you a little bit about this place, this is uh, uh, south of Seoul, Korea, on the other side of the river. We are south of the uh, Han River just a little bit. That's the right side of the river. Uh, we are, uh, the hospital is in a, uh, the main hospital is in a, uh, uh, bombed out, uh, knocked out uh, industrial school building. We have uh, quantities for uh, all our quarters, except the uh, the field grade officers. We have a temporary or a temp permanent building, and uh, it's quite an elaborate setup for this uh, uh, part of the country. We uh, carry around. Uh, three or 280 to 310, 15 patients permanently in the house and uh, do quite a bit of outpatient treatment. I believe uh, we even do more here than they did at Percy Jones if, if that's possible. We have a big uh, athletic field here. Nice uh, a helicopter landing strip that brings patients in from all over North Korea, the uh, patients that uh, need emergency surgery and things like that, they bring them in. They brought one in just this afternoon about three o'clock that uh, uh, shot, a soldier was shot by uh, a guard, he was a colored soldier arguing with a guard and the guard shot him either accidentally or some other way, I don't know. Uh, there really isn't too much to uh, to tell you about this doggone place. I've told you about all there is. There isn't much. I uh, haven't been down to uh, to Seoul yet. There's actually nothing to go over there for, and there isn't anything to buy unless you buy it in the PX, and that uh, is stuff that's made in Japan. Now, on uh, that uh, recording that you all made, Kurt said he was going to send a list of stuff he wanted to get, but you can't get anything over here. It might be that I could get a couple days uh, leave in Japan before I get back to pick up a few things there that uh, I would uh, uh, like to get that I missed the other time. And uh, that's about the only reason I would want to go over there. We're entitled to go on R&R uh, &R over there. That's rest and recuperation leave uh, of a week every four months. But I've been over here over eight months yet and haven't been able to go. Due to the Indochina situation, there's not uh, too many planes available for uh, uh, transporting people from here to Japan. So our, the number that uh, can go at any one time is limited. Uh, we only get... Uh, we get very few drops for our people here at the hospital. And uh, as a result, why, since we have over 500 working here, uh, the 
when it comes your time to go away, you're long past due. I enjoyed that, uh, that reel you all made there uh, very much. Uh, and of course, the, uh, the singing was, the machine didn't, wasn't adjusted too well and you, you could tell it was singing and hear all the voices, different people that were there. Of course, the kids hollering as usual. I, uh, yesterday I received a letter that you had sent up to Ninth Corps. They forwarded it down. It's dated the 3rd of June, so I got it over a month later. That's the way they, uh, your mail gets fouled up sometimes. Now, I haven't heard yet when I'm uh, leaving to go back to the States, but uh, my, uh, I expect to hear almost any day we, uh, there's two of us here got caught on that thing. There's a major that got caught uh, over age. He's uh, over 53, so they're uh, going to relieve him from active duty. He doesn't have 20 years yet, so I assume he'll have to uh, go back in as a master sergeant and stay until he gets 24, he can retire. Of course, I'm getting the bounce on for having over 28 years service. Apparently, this government contract only works one way. They extended my uh, category till 1957 and turn around and and uh, kick you out uh, before the category's up. It seems to work all in the government's favor. Well, we, uh, we had big doings here yesterday at the hospital. Uh, I'll tell you a little bit about it. Uh, on the other part of this reel, you... Uh, don't uh, turn it over or don't play it play it back just turn it over and uh, uh, keep on going I don't know uh, you, you might hear uh, uh, some of the little birds out here twittering I'm down in the office tonight and not up in the in the room it's real quiet down here there's nobody on duty but the charge of quarters out front now uh That'll be about all for for right now. And uh, I'll tell you a little bit uh, about this show and the uh, and the other part of the reel. So I'll say so long uh, for this part. and continue over.